rather than look inward and say, what am I doing that is keeping me from buying these big winners? You look at what are they doing to make money so easily? And my problem with, with that is if you don't look inward and say, what am I doing that's causing me to miss these winners? You're not learning. You're not adapting. Markets have always been changing. Right. This is not just in the last 20 years. I mean, you can imagine how much of a change there was in the, in the take India, 1960 through 1980 stock market versus 1980 through 2000. That was an even bigger quantum shift. Yeah. than what you've seen between 20 to in, the, in the last 20 years relative, because markets are constantly changing. And if investors and traders don't tr- change with them, they're going to fail. First thing to remember in investing is you don't have to play on any field, no matter how green it looks and how good it looks. That is, your, that is the power you have, right? You can choose when to play. And when you do decide to play, you set the rules. Mm. I mean, you can listen to these guys and say, so that's all fine, but these are my goalposts for you. And if you don't deliver, you can go tell other people that you'll move the goalposts, but I'm leaving. The power that we have as investors is to recognize that you're never, never forced to invest in a company. You're never forced to stay in a company. And, uh, you know, crypto coming over and people have been trying to challenge the dominance of dollar. So I need your perspective that are we going to see a different world in coming decade or is going to be the same story? I I think the word used was perspective. That's what we often lack. You know, the collective value of all cryptos in the face of the earth is. Give me a guess. What do you think it is? If you take Bitcoin and Ethereum and all the cryptos put together, what do you think that collective value is? I guess are hundred billion dollar. I don't know. It's just it's a about two and a half trillion, right? Sounds like oh. a lot of money. Yeah, but what's a what's a market cap of the largest company in the world? Yeah, that's almost there. Apple has a mar- has a market cap of three trillion. So think yeah. about it. 